the eight channel interface market. Long established, much needed, but take a look around and it all feels a bit, well, the same. And we're not interested in being the same. So what actually makes EVO 16 different from the rest of the market? We feel there are two main features that set EVO 16 apart from the crowd. One of those features is Smart Gain, a cleverly developed and lightning fast algorithm designed to automatically set the gain for all eight channels at once and in less than 20 seconds. Don't believe us? We thought you might say that, so we put it to the test. So Smart Gain helps you to avoid clipping and distortion and spend less time setting up and more time recording and making music. It also becomes incredibly powerful for those who work independently. Think of it as your own assistant engineer. Up next is Motion UI. We felt the current eight channel audio interface market was full of difficult to use features and complex user interfaces that just got in the way of recording. So we challenged ourselves to get rid of the confusing control systems, terrifying software apps, and the overbearing reliance on menu diving and created Motion UI, something we feel is the first of its kind. So what is Motion UI? What can it do? And how does it make your life easier? Let's find out. Motion UI is an onboard system designed to intelligently display information as you need it. Centered around Evo 16's full color, high resolution LCD screen, Motion UI works alongside Evo 16's hardware controls to provide a centralized, easy to use one knob control system for adjusting all of Evo 16's hardware parameters. Simply put, every adjustment, every detail, and every button press is beautifully displayed in real time, letting you navigate hardware features effortlessly, make changes on the fly, and take full control of your recording session without ever looking at your computer. Let's go through what Motion UI can do. Status screens are displayed whenever an input or output button is pressed and are designed to quickly provide key information specific to that channel. When pressing an input button, the input status screen will display the input number, the input name assigned via the Evo Mixer app, the gain setting, and an independent channel meter for referencing your levels. With an input selected, the hardware will now control that channel, so you can use the control wheel to adjust the input gain with decibel level accuracy as well as toggling channel mute, phantom power for condenser mics, or instrument mode for guitars and basses on channel one and two. To quickly mute a channel, simply hold down the channel button until the mute feature toggle screen is shown, and the channel button begins flashing. When a channel is muted, the gain level is replaced with the mute icon, and this will remain in place until mute is deactivated by again holding down the channel button. To activate phantom power, select the channel and press the 48 volt button, which will then illuminate red as well as activating a temporary feature toggle screen. 
This is set independently per channel, so if you navigate away to a different channel where phantom power isn't activated, the 48 volt button will no longer be illuminated. To turn off 48 volt, press the 48 volt button again, which will be shown on the feature toggle screen. Both channels 1 and 2 are able to switch to instrument mode, meaning they're able to be used to record guitars and basses. To do this, select either channel 1 or 2, and then press the instrument button. The button will then illuminate as well as display the temporary feature toggle screen. To turn instrument mode off, press the instrument button, which will again display the feature toggle screen. Now moving on to the output status screen. Similar to the input status screen with a few key differences, the output screen displays the output name, the volume level, stereo meters, as well as a feature activation display. With an output selected, the control wheel will now control the volume of that output, ranging from 0 to 100. To quickly mute an output, simply hold down the output button until the mute feature toggle screen is shown and the button begins flashing. When a channel is muted, the volume level is replaced with the mute icon, and this will remain in place until mute is deactivated by again holding down the output button. With the main speaker output selected, under the meter you are able to see the status of the output functions, dim, alt speaker, and mono. These are activated through the Evo Mixer app in the master section, or alternatively, you are able to assign them to the F button. Whenever these features are toggled, the corresponding feature toggle screen is displayed, before reverting back to the output status screen. The F button can also be used to activate talkback, enabling you to stay in contact with an artist through their headphones. This is configured in the Evo Mixer app's setting panel. When talkback is activated, whether using the F button or in the Mixer app, the talkback feature toggle screen is shown. If at any point you navigate to a different screen while TalkBack is still activated, the TalkBack icon will still be visible. With Motion UI, using SmartGain is easier than ever. To activate SmartGain, press the green SmartGain button. You will then be prompted to select the channels you want to set the gain for. Select the channels you want using the channel buttons, or press and hold the SmartGain button to quickly select all eight channels at once. Once you've selected the channels you require, press the SmartGain button again to start. You will now see a Smart Gain listening screen. This is where you or your artist will need to start performing in order for Smart Gain to analyze your signal. If all selected channels are successfully set, you will see the Smart Gain successful screen and you're ready to start recording. However, if an issue such as no signal or insufficient level is detected on one or more of the channels, you will see the issue detected screen followed by the Smart Gain status screen. The Smart Gain status screen gives you an overview of the status of each channel in relation to Smart Gain. Green means Smart Gain was successful, red means it failed, and gray means the channel was not selected. Smart Gain will now return you to the Select Channel screen with the failed channels automatically pre-selected. Simply press Smart Gain to start the process again. There is no need to select the green channels again as they were already successfully set. When not adjusting settings or pressing buttons on EVO 16, the screen will default to display either the input or output meters, depending on whether you last pressed an input or output button. The input meters display the level of all eight channels at the same time, enabling you to keep track of your recording levels. If you're using the digital inputs, you can quickly cycle through the input meter screens to view their levels by pressing the control wheel. The output meters display the levels coming out of your main speaker outputs and both your headphone outputs. Similar to the inputs, you can navigate to view the level of your line outputs and digital outputs by pressing the control wheel. You're able to control Evo 16 settings directly on the unit. To open the settings menu, momentarily hold down the control wheel. In the settings menu, you will find the options to power the unit down, customize the brightness levels of the LEDs, assign any of the monitoring functions to the hardware F button, check the audio status of your unit, and reset the unit to factory settings. So whether providing an easy to read visual feedback on your audio, working with our smart gain feature to automatically set your gain as well as identify which channels may have issues, to even notifying you exactly when the hardware features are switched on and off. Motion UI transforms the way you interact with an audio interface, turning it into a super intuitive and fully immersive experience, making it feel more familiar to the other smart devices we are used to using on a daily basis. A modern interface, for the modern studio.
So Motion UI makes taking control of your recording sessions a breeze, offering real-time visual feedback of your audio when you need it and conveniently right in front of you. Meaning you can say goodbye to constantly checking companion software apps and never-ending menu diving and say hello to a fast, intuitive workflow designed to keep your sessions in motion. Whilst Evo 16 may be smart, it is still an incredibly powerful audio interface under the hood, delivering the audio performance expected of Evo and Audient products. So here is a short video going over everything this game-changing interface has to offer. Evo 16 is our most powerful interface yet. Get studio quality recordings with eight built-in Evo preamps and advanced converter technology. Connect digital equipment for those larger recording sessions, giving you a max channel count of 24 in and 24 out. Add to that intelligent mic preamps that set their own levels with smart gain, the all new motion UI control system, audio loopback, and a whole host of other features. Evo 16 is truly a studio powerhouse designed from the ground up to make recording easy. So let's talk about the inputs. There are eight Evo mic preamps on combi jack inputs, enabling you to record microphones over XLR connections, as well as line level equipment such as synths or keyboards over TRS jacks. Our Evo preamp technology not only has the sonic advantages of an all analog mic preamp, but by being digitally controlled, it offers incredible precision, which gives you the ability to dial in gain levels with pinpoint accuracy down to the decibel, control preamps from software, perfectly match the levels of stereo pairs and make use of Evo 16's smart gain feature. So it's a digitally controlled analog mic pre, the best of both worlds. To build the perfect guitar or bass tone, you need the right foundation. So the first two inputs on the front panel feature our harmonically rich JFET instrument inputs. Designed to replicate the input stage of a classic valve amplifier, these inputs provide an ideal sonic foundation before you hit your guitar sims. Just plug in your instrument, set the channel to instrument mode, and get recording. One of the main factors that separates Evo interfaces from the competition is the smart gain feature. Powered by our lightning quick smart gain algorithm, it uses advanced peak analysis to automatically analyze, adjust, and set your gain to the perfect levels, all in less than 20 seconds. This is an incredibly powerful feature, letting you set the input levels for all eight inputs at the same time. So it's quick and easy to get going on those large and often time sensitive sessions, as well as making it easier for you to record on your own. For example, if you're a drummer and recording yourself, imagine being able to set up your mics, press the smart gain button, start playing, and 20 seconds later, your levels are dialed in and you're ready to record. So smart gain lets you save time, avoid clipping, and rest easy knowing your recordings will turn out great. To send audio out of Evo 16, there are eight line outputs to use with studio monitors or external equipment such as outboard gear or headphone amplifiers. You can also connect a second set of studio monitors and toggle between them using the alt speaker function. For listening on headphones, there are two dedicated headphone outputs on the front panel designed to drive even the most demanding headphones, perfect for artists when recording or for checking back to your own mix. With the huge amount of I.O. available, we've made sure to deliver on the audio performance. Providing a massive 121 dB of dynamic range, Evo 16's high-performance converter technology makes sure you're hearing your audio more accurately, helping you to confidently make creative decisions, identify issues, and just generally improve your all-round recording and mixing game. A powerful interface needs a powerful control system, and Evo 16's Motion User Interface, or Motion UI, has been designed to transform the way that you interact with an audio interface for the better. At the heart of Motion UI is the beautiful backlit full color LCD screen, which uses IPS technology to ensure the screen is always legible from multiple viewing angles, all while ensuring your key session information, such as metering, is displayed in crystal clear high resolution. Designed to keep you and your session in motion, Motion UI offers detailed visual feedback whenever interacting with the hardware, intelligently displaying information as and when you need it. So what do I mean by that? Well, pressing an input or output button will temporarily display the channel's name, the levels, and the functions activated for that specific channel, delivering information as and when you need it without forcing you to menu dive or opening software. When not interacting with any specific input or output, the screen will change to display all of your inputs and outputs, so you can keep an eye on them all mid-session. Motion UI also works alongside Evo 16's hardware controls, providing a centralized, easy-to-use, one-knob control system for adjusting all of Evo 16's hardware parameters. 
adjust the levels of your inputs and outputs, quickly mute inputs and outputs by holding down a channel button, or make use of the fully customizable F button, enabling you to assign any of Evo 16's advanced monitoring functions, such as toggling alternate speakers, mono summing, or activating talkback. This is an amazing feature on its own, which lets you use one of Evo 16's mic channels, a USB mic, or your computer's built-in mic to stay in touch with an artist over their headphones and quickly accessible with just the press of the F button. Motion UI allows Evo 16 to feel more like the smart technology that we're used to interacting with in our daily lives. So taking control of your recording sessions becomes incredibly intuitive and refreshingly simple. A modern interface for the modern studio. Future-proof your studio and configure your setup to tackle bigger sessions. Whether you're recording drums or a full band, Evo 16's optical inputs and outputs give you plenty of options for expanding your studio down the line by providing up to 16 extra inputs and outputs over ADAT and SPDIF. The accompanying Evo Mixer works hand-in-hand -hand with Motion UI by providing a software alternative to controlling your Evo 16, as well as letting you customize the audio routing, make use of the ultra-low latency direct monitoring, and creating custom headphone mixes using the intuitive Q system. Here, you can also delve into the deeper customization settings of Evo 16, which will allow you to tailor your experience to suit you. For those in the content creation space, whether podcasters, streamers, or gamers, the Evo Mixer also gives you control over the built-in audio loopback feature, which allows you to capture playback from applications on your computer at the same time as your microphones, offering powerful control over your audio before it hits your software. Although packed full with all these features, Evo 16 defies the norm with its deceptively small form factor. Evo 16 works perfectly whether on your desktop, under your laptop, or as a permanent fixture to your studio with the optional rack ears. Evo 16 is our most powerful interface yet. Its sonically stunning Evo preamps and converters give you next level audio performance. The smart gain feature across all eight channels offers a lightning fast way to get your sessions up and running, whilst the intuitive motion UI control system and option for expansion makes it effortless building up your professional studio rig. So there you have it, Evo 16 has everything you need to make professional quality recordings at home or in the studio. Jam-packed full of innovative and exciting new features, Evo 16 is truly a studio powerhouse designed from the ground up to make recording easy. For more information about Evo 16, check out our website, and if you have any questions, please leave a comment.